Hey guys, so this is going to be a Dollar Tree haul. I have just a couple of items at the very end of the video to show you guys from Walgreens. I got them on clearance, so I know it's been a while. I've said that in the last couple of videos. I told you guys that I'm doing a lot of working, so just bear with me. I'm going to go ahead and start showing you guys what it is that I found from Dollar Tree. So the first thing that I have to show you guys is this loofah. This is the turquoise colored loofah. They had these in bright hot pink and then purple. I don't think there were any other colors, but I could be wrong. And I do already have loofahs in the shower, but my little sister's down from Idaho and she always uses loofahs, so I always get her a new one when she comes down for the summer. And the brand of this says day in and day out, so I got that. I thought that was a pretty nice one. They had these new body washes, and I've told you guys that I always see new stuff while I'm working, and I end up putting it aside, whoops, I end up putting it aside, and I always forget it, or I just don't have time, and I made sure that I put these aside and actually purchased them, one, because I wanted them, and when we get new stuff like this, I know it'll go really fast, and then two, so I could show it to you guys. So I didn't smell any of these until I got home. They're 20 ounces each. The white ones are for women and the gray and blue are for men. And I think the one for women does smell good, but it's not like one of my favorite scents. But I really do like the way the one for men smells. It smells really good. So the one for women set, or women says with glycerin and vitamin E, nourishing cherry blossom for women. And then this one says also with glycerin and vitamin E, refreshing magnet, magnetic fresh for men. So I got all of those. I thought those were a pretty good size. And I like the fact that they have a pump on top. They had these Craft Indulgence Buttermilk Ranch. Um, it says twice churned 15 ounces. My manager actually put a couple of them aside for me. And we only got one box of them, so I picked up three of them. I've never tried this, so we'll see how we like it. And this expires. It says Best Buy 10 21 2017. So I got those. I picked up these Lip Smacker lip balm and lip glosses. And I think people were showing these a couple months ago. If these are the same ones, if not, they're very similar. And I was never able to find them. So, of course, I also made sure I got these right away. And you guys know my absolute favorite smell or scent is vanilla. So I picked up two of the Sunday Vanilla Caramel. And it's got the lip balm on top, like I said. And then there's the lip gloss on the bottom. I picked up one of the Punch Grenade Lemonade. And then this one I think is a pretty color with the lip gloss. It says Parfait Bluet Banane. And then this one is the Sorbet Framboy Framboise or Framboy Orange. And these are 0 0.13 ounces each. It says layer your flavors. Oh my gosh. Are those in... Those are, the ones I read were in a different language, the uh, flavors or scents. So this one's pomegranate lemonade punch. This one is vanilla caramel sundae. This one is blueberry banana parfait. And this one is raspberry orange sorbet. You guys know that's just me. Ding dong. So I got that. They had these super pretty stickers, you guys. I picked up this set right here. You guys know I absolutely love gold. So you get 26 of these stickers right here. It says, hooray, love, best day ever, celebrate, congrats. And it's double-sided. I picked up multiples in that set. And then I picked up multiples in this set, which was my favorite. And you get 134 of these little stickers in each one. I think these would be perfect for your planner, greeting cards, just whatever you want. It says sentiment stickers. And I'm not going to read all of the words on here, obviously, but just a couple. Elegant, be creative, amazing, I love you, shake it off. Oops, let's do it, hooray. So those I was really excited about. I picked up this little... 
set of the Sassy and Chic nail stickers. They had a couple other ones that were really cute, and this one looked familiar to me. I couldn't remember if this was one I had gotten in the past, but I didn't want to chance it, and then it would be gone. So it's got the pink with glitter, the purple or magenta purple with glitter, and then the floral, and I love that cursive one. I think that one's really pretty, so you get 19 of those. I picked up two packs of wipes. I got this Huggies one. It's fragrance free. The Huggies ones tend to be a little bit thicker. And then I got the travel pack of the Pampers. So the Huggies set has 32, but the Pampers only has, I think, like 20 or something like that. And I keep wipes in the bathroom. They just didn't have the larger packs of the ones I normally get. We needed Q-tips really bad, so I just went ahead and picked up a box of the Assured 100% Pure Cotton. I really don't like buying their Q-tips. I think they're flimsy and kind of generic. I get the ones from 99 Cent Only. You get like a 1,000 in a bag, and those ones, I think, compare really well to the actual Q-tip brand. They're very durable, but... You know, when you need something really bad, it was like convenience thing. And I don't keep them in the box. As you can see, I've already opened them. I have this box, which I had gotten from Dollar Tree like years ago, maybe two or three years ago. And I put all of the Q-tips in this box in the bathroom drawer. I do that with the Q-tips from 99 Cent Only as well. And that comes in like a big messy bag, so that makes it a lot more neat and convenient. I had already picked up um, either one or two of this pink cosmetic bag. I also got the blue and gold one. I went ahead and picked up one more in the pink. It says Killing It, and it's got the baby blue zipper on top because I want to fill that up with some little makeup items and give it away as a gift. I picked up a pack of the Assured Extra Comfort Floss in the mint. It's 27.3 yards, so that's a lot of dental floss. And I like the satin, what is the brand? It's from Target, and it, it's like, this is the knockoff to it. I like that dental floss, and I've used this once before, and it wasn't bad. My manager had put aside these frozen headbands, and she put aside three for me, but I told her I just wanted one. I think this is super cute. It's got the blue glitter, and then it's got the bow with Elsa and Anna on it. And I have a couple of frozen items put aside from Dollar Tree, so if I have a birthday or something like that, maybe at Christmas, I'll put together a little frozen gift set. I picked up three packs of the, and I actually stepped on it so the box is messed up, um, three boxes of the Suavitol dryer sheets. This is the morning sun. They also have the blue one and you get 20 sheets, but I wanted to switch it up and get the yellow one. These I did not purchase on this trip, but I wanted to quickly tell you guys that when I had smelled both of them, I thought they smelled good, but now I absolutely hate them. I have multiples in each, and I'm just going to give them away. I don't know what it is, especially the Soho uh, Social or whatever it is. It's got citrus and mimosa flower. It's got a very just alcohol smell, like an alcoholic drink. And then this one, it's green tea and aloe. I don't know. I guess normally I would like it, but I just, something about it I don't like. So I just wanted to give you guys my opinion on those. I had said maybe two months ago that I knew we were going to end up getting fidget spinners at the Dollar Tree. And sure enough, once again, my manager put um, a couple aside for me. I got three of them and they're glow in the dark. And they're pretty heavy duty. I got yellow, lime green, and then a, a super cute pastel pink one. And I think it's the yellow one. It doesn't, I mean it spins, but it doesn't spin for very long. But the pink one and the lime green one are the longest um, time spinners we have because we have multiples. It even outspun the one we got for my son at the mall for 20 bucks. So um, I think it's just kind of a hit or miss. So I thought those were a good deal for a buck. I picked up two of the soft soap and the soothing aloe vera. On my last trip, I got the milk and honey, and I did pick up one more of the milk and honey. 
I haven't got the soothing aloe vera in a long time, and it's not my favorite, but it is super moisturizing. It's 7.5 ounces, and they have the soft soaps at Dollar Tree that are smaller than that, so I like to get the larger ones because they last a little bit longer. I went ahead and picked up one of the scrunchy three-piece sets. It's the Everyday and Active Mix and Match set, and they had a couple other ones just like this with different prints and colors, but I liked this one. I think I'm going to split this up in between me and my sister or just give her the entire thing. I picked up this pack of the stickers. You get six of them, and they're like these bubble stickers, and they've got water in them with these um, really cute silver stars. So I just got one of those for now. I picked up another one of my Barbie detanglers. It's in the cotton candy. It says smooths and untangles hair 8 fluid ounces. And um, I really like this. I've been using it for years and years. I actually wish they still had. And yes, you can get the, in, the liquid infusium. But I don't know if you guys remember the liquid infusium where it had the little thing that popped up. I wish they had the old... Um, like, you know, where it has the old formula. They came out with a new one with the new scent. I would still buy that as my everyday detangler if I could. I picked up another box of the GKC, which is the Green Briar Kennel Club brand dog biscuits. This is the variety pack. It's got beef, chicken, turkey, bacon, and sausage. 16 ounces, so one pound. Cupcake has been eating these dog treats for... Years and years, you know, since I've had her. Well, she is four, so maybe about three and a half years. And um, they don't have anything harmful in them. I always tell you guys when I show these, there's another dog brand that looks very similar to this. And it's got G something, I think. And that one does have propylene glycol. So make sure that you get the GKC, Green Briar Kennel Club, because there's no propylene glycol in these ones. And she gets one of those a day. They came out with lots of new, really pretty greeting cards, and at first, sorry, the dog biscuit crumbs got everywhere. At first, I picked up like 12 different ones, but I put them back, and I decided I'll get them a little bit at a time. And we have the dollar cards, where they're a dollar each, and then the two for a dollar ones. And believe it or not, these ones were two for a dollar. So I got multiples of this one. These are like get well or encouraging cards. This one says, know why angels have wings. It's got the really pretty glitter with the cute hearts. And then I swapped it out for, um, oh, there's another one, for this magenta pink envelope because I thought it matched and made it look even prettier. I picked up this one, and I also swapped it out for this color envelope because, tell me this card is not super pretty, especially with this envelope. This has all the really gorgeous flowers with the glitter, and it says the time worth celebrating is now, and this one is just blank on the inside. I'm not going to read this one, but here's the outside, and then you can pause it if you want to read the inside. They had a new, um, it's like a pet, pet little spot where all the cards have cats and dogs on them. They had a whole new line of bridesmaid, maid of honor, bachelorette get well. So definitely check out your greeting card section the next time you guys go in. I picked up another pack of the men, men's premium quarter socks. You get three pairs in the size 8 to 13. We've actually been having lots of fires and there was a super, well actually there is a super huge fire in Mariposa and Jordan's been going up there every day and helping, you know, just whatever they need help with, handing out Gatorades, doing laundry, anything like that. So I wanted to get a couple of extra socks that we could just toss because all the stuff he brings back is covered in, like, really thick, dusty, almost like a orangey-looking clay dirt, and it's really hard to clean. Oh, and I had got this down because when I get the biscuits, I just put them in this little um, container, and I actually got this at the Dollar Tree a couple years ago as well. They have those in pink. I picked up a palm olive or ultra palm olive soft touch soap. It's the almond milk and blueberry scent. It's 10 ounces of the soap. It says soft hands. I needed another Ajax. I go in between the Ajax and the Comet at Dollar Tree. I use this for my bathtubs and my bathroom sinks. It's 
28 ounces, so that's 1 pound and 12 ounces. It's got bleach in it, so I got that. I picked up this Olay bar soap, and I don't like buying these because they're really small, and Olay is not bad, but I prefer Dove or Crest, but they didn't have any of the Dove bars, so just until I can get to Walmart, I picked up the Olay Ultra Moisture Shea Butter, and it is 3.17 ounces of the bar soap. I have so many of the cute little... Um, bags from Dollar Tree and Ross. I thought this one was cute. They have the matching little canvas pictures to this. They have just a couple things with this print and says Think Happy. I think they have journals. So you could even do like a little gift set of this. It says Think Happy and it's got the cute bright flowers with the print on the sides. I picked up this gift bag right here. And I have another gift bag that's similar, and they still have it in stock. It's got black and gold on it, and it reminds me of this. I think if you were to be giving away multiple gifts, this gift bag with the one that's got the black, the gold, and the pink would be really cute together. I thought this was just way too cute to pass up. It's got the really pretty cake, the bow. It says, Happy Birthday. And at first, I thought it was going to be a wedding bag, and I still buy them, but I was happy it was a birthday bag because... I use birthday more than I do wedding, so I got that. I picked up six of the home store bath tissue toilet papers. It says more value, now at 275 sheets per roll, 50% more sheets. So it is 122.2 square feet. You would think I would remember that considering I purchased these packs so many times. I do prefer getting toilet paper at Target or Walmart, but I've told you guys it's a convenience thing. I had forgotten to show this to you guys in my last video. I had showed you guys, and I still have some more stuff to show you guys, but I had showed you guys the Hello Kitty um, Oral-B Power Toothbrushes, and the thing I like about these ones is it doesn't just vibrate. The head actually spins and vibrates. So I had showed those to you guys, and they always have Hello Kitty toothbrushes at Dollar Tree and 99 cent only, but this is like a newer style one. So this is the kid's Oral-B, and it's got little Hello Kitty, and she's got the Hawaiian look to her with the little Hawaiian flowers. So I wanted to show that to you guys. I think I already showed you guys the chest rub. If I did, I apologize. It's the Assured. It says compared to Vicks Vapor Rub. Jordan pulled something in his shoulder, so I got that. I picked up the men's Right Guard Sport Fresh deodorant. It is 1.0 ounces. I picked up this set of stickers, and it says Friends Forever, Together We Are. I'm not going to read all of them, but I thought this was pretty. They also had one next to it with little conversation bubbles, and they had different sayings in them, but I went ahead and passed on that one for now. It's the glitter set with 21 of the stickers in there. They had some super cute calendars, you guys, and I always give out calendars for gifts at Christmas. I like to do like a calendar with like a really nice box of chocolates or a bag of Starbucks coffee and a Starbucks gift card or just something like that. I got this one right here. It says, Love the Journey. 2018 12-month calendar. It's got the flamingo on it, the really pretty flower. And then look how cute um, the pictures are. So it says, be honest, be sly, be kind. I'm not going to read them all. Look at this one. It says, wake up and make up. So it's almost like break up to make up. There's that one. The pineapple one that says, be a pineapple, stand tall, wear a crown, and be sweet, which I love. The little bike one. Look how cute the Christmas one is. Silent night, holy night. So I just thought that was adorable. This one was my very favorite. It's Farmhouse Kitchen 2018 12-month calendar. It looks like it's got the wood grain on the back. It's got the fork, knife, and spoon with the flowers. Look at these super cute pictures, you guys. Tell me these are not... Look at the coffee thing. It says perk up. Eat well, shake it up with the salt and pepper shaker, always be grateful with the cheese grater. So I picked up multiples of um, this calendar because I will definitely be 
um, including these in gifts because I love it. I'm going to give one to my Grammy. And then I got this one. They had one with um, birds on it, but I went ahead and passed on that one. This one is Wild Heart and Free Spirit. I absolutely love that. And then look how pretty these pictures are as well. You are loved. Patience is the companion of wisdom. Dream a little bigger. That one. Just super pretty. So they did a really good job on their calendars. They had small calendars. They also had some really cute student planners this year. Let me see what else I have to show you guys. Oh, this is already open. It's the Glade Cla sorry, Glade Cashmere Woods. The Cashmere Woods is my favorite scent in Glade. And I don't normally buy these. I don't think they work well. And I thought, you know what? My little sister's coming. So I put one, this one actually, in the front bathroom, which is the guest bathroom. And I haven't been able to smell it. So I'm not going to purchase these or go back to not purchasing them. I don't know if I already showed the Barbie Detangler. I think I did. I got some vegetable oil. I already tried filming this one other time, so I'm trying to remember what I did and didn't show you guys. Let me see you guys. Okay, so I had told you guys about the really cute keychains or purse tassels, and I had put them aside, and someone put them back, and someone bought the whole box, so I wasn't able to get them. Well, they came out with more boxes, so I snagged them up, and I purchased them the same day that I saw them, which was like two days ago, so I got two of the gold and one of the silver. I think these are really pretty, especially for a dollar. These would be really cute for putting in a little makeup bag with, you know, maybe one of the little lip smackers. There's just so many different little cute gift ideas I get from the stuff at Dollar Tree. So that's what the top looks like, and it's got the little, um clasp so you can put it on your purse or your keychain. I picked up this pack of the Color Point Detail Coloring Metallic Markers. It's got the gold and the silver, and I had actually thought of doing a gold and silver themed, um, a gold and silver themed haul for you guys with, um, there's the second one. I knew I got multiples, like, you know, of the gold stickers, the gold and silver stickers, the gold and silver markers, the tassels, because I've gotten quite a bit of gold and silver stuff, but just with how much I've been working and how busy I am, I wasn't able to do that, so I just decided to include it in this video. I picked up one of the soft soap, milk, and golden honey. I got multiples of these on my last trip. So I got, um, like I showed you, the Soothing Aloe Vera as well. I picked up, and I picked up the Small Palm Olive Soft Touch and this on two separate days. So this is the original Palm Olive. It's 16 ounces. I really like the smell of the original Palm Olive. So it's 25% more free. Oh, here's another one of the Milk and Golden Honeys. And then I picked up two packs of these little, um, like, seed starters. I have some seeds from the Dollar Tree, and these have the holes on the bottom, and you get multiples of them. I think I've already even taken some out of this pack. I think I took three out of this pack, and they have the larger ones as well, so these are perfect for that. I have a couple things that I um, didn't get out like the um carefree panty liners i picked up this thing of the nestle nesquik you get six of the envelopes i got a thing of the pop weaver extra butter three bags of popcorn 6.75 ounces what else is down here sorry guys i know it's no fun looking really up close to my blanket they had this Campbell's Chunky Baked Beans Maple Bacon and Beer. This is 20.5 ounces. I love, um, like, sweet beans. My grandma makes some really good um, ham hocks and beans. And they also had this in a sriracha. And Jordan does like sriracha, but his stomach has been a little sensitive lately. So I went ahead and just got this one. 
And I know bacon and beer probably isn't the best, but I think sriracha would be a little bit worse. So I thought we could do this with, um, like, barbecued hot dogs and barbecued chicken. I also got multiple packs of the hot dogs from Dollar Tree, which I didn't get out of the refrigerator. I got the Busy Baker hot dogs and bread as well, which you have to get right when you see because it goes really fast. I got multiples of the chunky chicken noodle soup, and we do get the chicken noodle all the time. It's in, um, it's a name brand, and it's, like, got no, um, sodium or no salt, but this Hanover brand, to me, is actually better, and we'll have this sometimes for dinner, like soup and a sandwich, or for lunch. It's pretty filling. I picked up another thing of the Las Palmas taco sauce. Um, my mom has used the Las Palmas since I was a little girl, and... Um, we do tacos for dinner. I call them the white tacos. Sometimes we do like the carne asada tacos, try to make them authentic, but we also do the white tacos. I like those, and we'll use the Las Palmas for that. Of course, I picked up multiples of um, the Nestle Coffee Mate, six ounces. You guys know I always pick that up. I got a couple of the Del Monte mushroom paste sauces. I got mushroom and onion. These are 24 ounces, so 1.5 pounds for spaghetti. And I'm not even showing you guys half of the food, not even a quarter of the food items I got because it would take too long. I needed to go grocery shopping anyways, and I go to like Walmart, Target, or wherever. I go to Save Mart, but I like to get lots of little stuff at Dollar Tree, and since my little sister was coming... I wanted to make sure that there was extra in the house stuff to make for dinners and snacks. So I got a rice roni and the chicken, 6.9 ounces. I got two packs of the fudge brownies made with Dutch cocoa, 10.25 ounces so we can make brownies. They also had the white macadamia and peanut butter, and I forgot to get those out of the cupboard. I got those while I was there. I picked up some waffles, which those are in the freezer. So I got another thing of the Harvest Hill Original Pancake Syrup, 24 ounces. And I'm really happy because they used to only get the light. Now they get the original because I hate, hate, hate light syrup. They had the actual um, Betty Crocker Bisquick Three Cheese Biscuits. And um, I've never had these. And all you do is add water. I like stuff where you only add water and like a little bit of oil. Super easy to make. So I thought I would get those, and we could give those a try with a dinner or a breakfast. Well, probably not a breakfast, but maybe a dinner. I got multiple cans of the mini raviolis, and these are 15 ounces. I'm going to go ahead and move on to, I believe the rest of the stuff I have is like food. Oh, wait, no, I wanted to show this stuff to you guys, too. I got multiples of the Farmer John Maple Pork Links. You get eight of them, and I get these all the time from Dollar Tree. I think they're really good. I got a pack. I don't like setting these on my blanket. They're all wet. Um, that's why I don't like showing a lot of the food items. So I got a pack, well, actually multiples, of the crinkle cut French fried potatoes. It's one pound and four ounces. We'll do like French fries and tater tots for lunch with macaroni and cheese or something. Um, I love these Buyer Best Southern Style Hash Browns. We make these with eggs. Um, we do the potatoes with onions, we'll do bacon with toast, stuff like that. And this is one pound and eight ounces, so that's a pretty good deal. And the John Morelli, it's like the um, two long sausages, that just fell down, so I can't reach it or else I would show that to you. So I did get that. I picked up a couple of the Genio turkey bacons. I do have regular bacon in the freezer as well, which I prefer, but I thought this was a good deal, so I got that. And the John Morelli sausages, the long ones that fell, um, I cut those up into um, little, like, you know, just little pieces, and um, we eat them like that. I got multiples of the eggs, and they go in between the brown and the white. So as you can see, these ones are the brown. I prefer the brown, but um, they don't always have them. So it's the California Ranch Fresh brand Anything goes with eggs, and it's the um, CA Seth's complaint, so that means that the chickens are not, um, like, crammed into cages. They run freely. So, now I'm going to show you guys three things from 
the Wish app that I ordered, then I'll show you the Walgreens stuff if my camera doesn't shut off. So this is one of the items I got from the Wish app, and I'm not loving it. I still have a couple more that are coming in the mail. The only reason that I'm not loving it is because the white to me seems like kind of dingy looking. The black seems kind of faded. The lash out part with the gold is fine, and it just came with just... Um, like the cover and so I have an older throw pillow in there and I have one that has more gold on it I think it has like lips or a heart or something coming I got where are they these two cases and I think I'm gonna give these away as gifts um, they're really cute but they're really hard and what I don't like about these cases is the opening on the bottom with the zipper isn't very wide. So the size pillow that you would fit in here to make it nice and tight and fitted isn't going to fit because you could rip it. So then you have to put a smaller pillow and it ends up looking like this pillow where it's a little bit, um, you know, it's got extra fabric and I don't like that. So anyways, I got all the pillowcases. These ones right here, the Disney ones, were free, just paid shipping, and I think the shipping was 2 or $3. And then the other ones were either free as well, or they were a dollar, $2 shipping. I don't remember, but they were super cheap. So I got the Bell one, and you can tell it was spray painted because there's a little bit of fallout um, spray paint on the sides, but it's still super cute. And um, like I said, these are really cute. I just don't like the material. It's like... Um, almost like a rice sack. It's like really hard. And then I got Ariel. I also got Snow White, I believe it was, but she's not here yet. So those were the Wish items. And then quickly, let me show you what I got from Walgreens. I actually needed to get um, a $65 Visa gift card from there. So when I went in, um, I needed shampoo. So I got my Suave Sleek shampoo, and it was on sale for $3.19 which isn't what I wanted to show you. Um, they had these. I'm not going to get them all out. I'll just get two of them out. But I bought multiples of these, you guys, for Christmas. These were on clearance. And the tag, as you can see, says $10. And it's the Christian Siriano Syria New York brand. It's got the cute mug with the turquoise. It says, enjoy every moment. And I got these on clearance for $3.00 with my rewards card. So inside, it's got the Christian Seriano New York Coconut Fragrance Moisturizing Body Lotion. It's got the body wash and the cute little loofah. So I thought, you know what? For $3, I'm going to buy multiples of these, and they're going to get put aside for Christmas because I always start early, especially if I see clearance stuff, and it's cute like this. So, and I'll give this away with, like, a box of chocolates or a thing of Starbucks coffee with the Starbucks gift card and that'll go to like distant family members. I always bring um, like one of my big Ross totes and I put stuff like this in there with extra cards in case someone extra shows up that I forgot about and it's not awkward like they have a gift for you and you don't have one for them or even if they don't have one for me I still like to give everyone a gift. So I know this has been a really long video. I'm going to go ahead and cut it. I need to drink my coffee, and I'm going to eat a little bit of breakfast. I hope you guys enjoyed this super long haul, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.